In this video we're going to take a look at the weak RSA challenge on Hack the Box. It's an easy crypto challenge and the description says can you decrypt the message and get the flag? So I solved this three and a half years ago. Can't remember how to solve the challenge but I'm guessing it's to do with RSA. Let's take a copy of this. Uh, the two files, we've got a, an encrypted flag and we've got a public key. And let's take a look at the files. Right, so let's just check the file types first. So you've got data, ASCII text, cat out the flag, and it's obviously jumbled up cipher text here, we can't recognize it. Doesn't recognize it, uh, doesn't print even most of the ASCII characters. And then we have our key.pub, which you'll see even looking at this is quite small and obviously the challenge is called weak RSA so let's go and see how we can what sort of tools we can use to potentially break the RSA here so I'm just gonna go and search here crypto CTF tools and let's open couple of links here. Alright, I'm going to open the first two. And this um, this link actually is worth saving. I'll put it in the description. This has a list of, we have some crypto tools to use here, but we also have uh, a lot of other tools suggested for exploits, for forensics, for um, networking, reversing, steganography. So, um, these will be handy for other categories as well, his web as well. So um it's worth keeping keeping a hold of this link. I'll I'll put it in the description. So what tools can we use for crypto? We've got a modular cryptanalysis tool here, feather duster, hash length extension attacks, PK crack for breaking zip encryption, a tool for covering RSA private key with various attacks, that sounds good and also our RSA tool generate private key with knowledge of P and Q. We don't have not been given P and Q in this case. We've just got the, we've got the public key, so maybe we want to have a look at these attacks. And we also have an X an XOR tool here as well. We might be able to let me just have a quick look as well in um let's have a quick look at this site. Alright, this is kind of giving a link to links to um a lot of other tools I'll put this in the description as well but let's let's uh, move on to some of these tools anyway let me just quickly open cyberchef and see what they have for RSA I'm presuming RSA okay so they've got RSA dec decrypt we can generate an RSA key pair if we go to decrypt we need to give a private key so there's no there doesn't appear to be any kind of attacks that we can actually do here on RSA so let's go and have a look at the RSA CTF tool I'll put this in the description as well so let's look at the readme here first of all you can see RSA multi tool multi attacks tool uncipher data from weak public key and try to recover the private key automatic selection of best attack for the given public key so we can give it a public key and it's going to select out of these various attacks by the sound of it to um, hopefully retrieve the private key or decrypt the message and in our case we want to uncipher the message so we want to pass in RSA CTF tool we want to give it our public key dash dash public key and then we want to use uncipher and pass it the flag and hopefully that will do it for us um, in this case I believe I have the RSA CTF tool installed but I'm gonna download it into the, just the local environment here just to in case we run into well I already have it installed in my system so I probably won't run into any problems here but I might do it outside of the Python environment let's have a look I'm gonna do git clone and let's go CD into RSA CTF tool Let's do Python RSA CTF tool just to get the help up again. And we want to pass it the public key, dash dash public key. And then we'll give it key.pub. 
and then we want to uncipher file actually that's what we want or we could cat at the 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 um output as well but let's just do un uncipher file it sounds good good for for now flag .enc and yeah let's just try that so it can't load some things because sage is not installed sage is not installed let's have a quick look at this Yeah, obviously we don't have Sage installed. Makes sense. Um, hmm. You find binaries. Can we not? Um, Sage math. All right, let's just install it. Ooh. Depends on SQLI. All right, let me try and fix this. Okay, I fixed that. So for me, if you have that problem with Sage not being installed, I um, tried to install sudo apt get install Sage, and it. Um, oh, Sage Math, it didn't work, but the Sage Math common worked for me and that fixed the problem. Note that we didn't, I didn't actually need it, it was still able to find the flag um, even though those errors came up. But since installing the Sage Math, we now have um, no errors coming up for the different attacks. It's able to try each of the attacks and uh, we'll wait and, and get the flag here as well. You can see there that we private argument wasn't set so the private key won't be displayed even if recovered so we could have tried to recover the private key there as well it's taken a while if we were specifying I guess an attack type it probably we can I'm sure we can yeah we can specify dash dash attack And there we have it timed out actually trying to do the Euler attack and then it just went straight to our results here. It doesn't actually doesn't actually show what the successful results were, but we can see that we've got our flag indicating that it's uh Weiner's attack. Um so if we were to if we were to just specify that attack we could do dash dash attack and what was the option for private I think just is it just to just dash dash private to we'll do dash dash private I think um, attack winer and and dash dash private. All right, so that retrieved us the RSA private key and it ran very quickly as you notice there compared to the previous one. It actually gives us the time in here as well. It's less than a second to perform the Weiner attack. And it's given us the unciphered, unciphered data in various formats. And that's the challenge. So I hope you've enjoyed this video. We got to check out this new tools, RSA CTF tool, which we'll maybe come across again in some more of these challenges. And uh, we'll we'll uh, keep and keep uh, we'll refer back to this site as well to check out some of these. I uh, hope you've enjoyed the video. Any questions, comments, leave them down below. Thanks.